Oh guys, math movies here. We're two parcels. A bit far back because I'm very cautious about my dress. <laughs> For all you know, you could be weirdos. Hopefully not. <laughs> we have some great parcels there. Have a pretty big one there. It's pretty thick. And you have another thick one there. So yeah, two thick ones. And I'm going to open this one first because the other one's a box set and it's more bigger. But yeah, I'll save the rest of that. First of all, we have yeah, Miller's Crossing. It's a Coen Brothers film. I really like their movies. I'm trying to collect them all. I uh, don't have many of their movies. And I now have all their movies apart from two, which I can't have. So, technically, I have all of them uh, for, for my age. I, do. I just can't get Fargo and Sword of Davis yet. But, what about older, I'll try to get them. But, yep, 15 uh, special features. Shooting Miller's Crossing. A conversation with Barry. Sonnefeld? Mm -hmm. There's an interview, a trailer, still gallery, interactive menus and scene access. Thank God, no audio commentaries. Every film I buy lately has an audio commentary. And I don't know how I'm going to watch them. Oh, that's an awesome desk. <laughs> that's a cool desk, that is. There you can see, like, a hat. Uh, it looks like a really good film. I think it's supposed to be great. It's got good reviews, I think, so hopefully it's good. And there's one more now. Oh. Yeah, we have. Ooh. We have a oh, brother by right there. Uh, it's a Coen Brothers film, number one. Uh, this, I think these people are not searching for a brother or something. It says they have a plan but not a clue. And, uh, so that's George Clooney. Who, uh, I don't know, he's decent in the Coen Brothers films though. I don't like him as an actor aside from their films. You know, I think he's fairly annoying, but yeah. Uh, 12, it goes on for 103 minutes, I haven't taken a long time on this one, uh, 110 minutes, so they're both long. And, um, not many special features, just interviews, just interviews, a trailer, TV spots, subtitles. I don't know why they list subtitles in the special features, because it's not really special at all. You, you get it on every DVD, so I don't know how it's special. Oh, that's cool. Nice disc. And what's that? Huh, that's cool. It's like a little thing there, and uh, they ask you stuff. I did this when DVDs first come out, they'll send you one of these. Uh, and uh, it says, like, which format are you most interested in? DVD or VHS? DVD. Which genre are you interested in? Sci-fi. Uh, male or female? I think I know that. <laughs> Name, address, all that. It's pretty, pretty cool, and then you send it off to them, and then they'll try to fulfill your wishes for your DVDs. So that's pretty cool. You get them in a lot of old DVDs. So uh, that must mean this DVD's pretty old. So yep, yeah, that's the two for that parcel. And we have one more. The big one. I got I got that for £1.30 and that was the same. And then we have the big one. Well that is thick. That's really big. collection and by the way I thought I was probably wondering if it's an 18 but I can't watch The Big Lebowski because that has like, hundreds of F words which is just ridiculous it's very unneeded in films it really is that's an awesome set you got a serious man apparently Hebrew and Yiddish for goys as a bonus feature I'm not really interested in learning, learning Yiddish but I'll have a look at that <laughs> <laughs> we have intolerable cruelty. Interesting name. <laughs> yeah, it is cruelty being in a relationship with George Clooney, so I do understand that name. And you have Blood Simple. It's supposed to be great. Fat and Think. Uh, that's supposed to be good as well. Uh, the Hudsucker Proxy. I have no clue. <laughs> it's a PG, so I don't know. That's the one I can't watch. The Big Lebowski, which it has. Uh, 300 F words, which that, that's just like every second, so that's just pointless even watching. And then Burn After Reading, which I have seen and I have in my collection, but I'm selling it uh, because I have it now in this set. It's a lovely set, but if you get all them, oh great, I don't know what all they're going now. Serious Man, ah, that's how it goes. Serious Man, Burn After Reading, Dijabowski, Hudson. Simple, simple, simple. Great picture. It's pretty cool. Of uh, supposed to be the two Coen brothers. 
think that's in the right order. Does it look right? Do you think it looks right? Yeah, I'm not sure. It says they go in that order. It says they go in that order, though, apparently. So, yep, plop them all in. And that is a, as we said, this, is, this was a bargain of the week. That was, I bought this set for £3. £3 for seven films is an excellent price, especially considering when these, the, the directors who make these films, their films go for expensive prices, or like £3, £4, and to get them up for £3 is one, one of the best deals I've ever gotten. So, yep, that's awesome parcel today. <laughs> that is absolutely fantastic. Um, lovely set, very nice, very colourful. It's just nice to get sets like that. So, yeah, it was a huge Coen Brothers Mal Day, all of their, all of their films. Uh, I have four in my room, so I now have all of them, really. I've got most of them. So, yeah, that's all for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and um, awesome parcels, so I'll see you soon, and, yeah, bye.